And the governor was at Tampa General Hospital talking about effective treatments for COVID. Now tonight, roughly 12,000 patients are hospitalized with coronavirus across the state and hospitals, they want you to know what they're dealing with. It's just been nonstop. The summer is usually the slow season for hospitals, but not this year. COO Glenn Waters says BayCare is caring for more than 800 COVID patients. With hospitals full and staffing tight, tonight the system is forced to pause some elective procedures. When you drive around the community, it feels like nothing's going on because everything's hustle and bustle and very, very busy, but yet. We've got more COVID patients in the hospital now than we ever have. Why do you think we are seeing this peak and what is the state doing to address it? So I think we anticipated, I said publicly, this is our COVID season. We thought we would see an increase. But not this much of an increase. During a news conference at Tampa General, Governor Ron DeSantis told me the Delta variant is clearly more contagious. With the majority of seniors vaccinated, the younger unvaccinated group is filling up our hospitals. Some Tampa and Orlando hospitals are breaking records, but the governor says parts of the state, including Miami-Dade, are seeing less COVID patients than before. Part of the state's tactic, get out the message about monoclonal antibody treatments, the topic of the governor's news conference today. The name of the game is, you know, if you're infected, we just want you to be okay. And uh, if you do this, the chance of you having one of those 14-day hospital stays in the ICU goes down dramatically. Much of the public isn't familiar with this treatment that neutralizes the virus. But if taken early with the onset of symptoms, doctors say monoclonal antibodies are incredibly effective. So again, doctors say monoclonal antibody treatments, they work whether you are vaccinated or unvaccinated. But again, this is critical. You need to seek this treatment very early, soon after you have symptoms, definitely within seven days. Now, we want to be clear that Tampa General is not pausing any elective procedures tonight, Keith. That is just Baycare.